Hi, I'm Peter Lindemann and um, this is Tesla Chargers. Today I want to talk about the uh, amazing Bedini Crystal Battery Light. Uh, this is probably the only true uh, emergency light that you need uh, if Armageddon hits tomorrow. Um, or if it hits in 50 years because um, this, this um, emergency lighting system uh, has its own what's called a crystal battery and uh, it will never go bad so uh, it comes with its own uh, instruction sheet and the instructions are pretty easy what we're going to do is um, all you have to do is add a little bit of water and the light will operate for uh, a day or two and then you can add a little bit more water and it'll operate a couple more days and um, so what I want to do is I want to show you a little bit about this. Um, uh, the, the crystal battery consists of this uh, copper um, section and this zinc section. Or this is magnesium, I believe. John, this is magnesium, right? Yeah. Okay. Co copper and magnesium. Yeah, magnesium. And then the, the crystal material. Um, uh, around it, which is now in a dry state. Now, um, what we can see is, is uh, it will show a voltage of 1.288 volts, okay, but um, uh, there's really no current available at this time. If I, if I turn the unit on, you can see that the light does not come on, even though there's a voltage there, okay? Now, all we have to do, um, the unit comes with um, there's, there's no assembly anymore. Uh, it comes completely ready to use. Uh, and it comes with its own uh, little syringe. And I've got a little cup of distilled water. Really important to use distilled water because we don't want to add any other minerals or ions uh, to this because that will clog up the, the electrochemical pathways. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw up a little bit of water here. About, about two milliliters. Okay, and I'm going to, all I have to do is I'm going to add the water a little bit around the, on the, on the crystalline material. Okay, so I've added a, just approximately two milliliters of water. Okay, and, and I'm just letting that soak in. We can probably see that the voltage has, oh, the voltage has gone up now to 1.7 volts but I still have it turned off, but now I'm going to turn it on and we see the light, okay? Now the light is on and uh, just by doing this, the light will uh, run for about um, um, so under load, you can see uh, the, the voltage will drop to about 0.88 volts, okay? But uh, the unit will run for uh, anywhere from 12 to 36 hours and um, so that's pretty pretty bright I'll tell you if you're in the dark this is a, this is plenty of light uh, for you to do whatever you want and um, then you can uh, add more water and it will run again so uh, and then if it dries out uh, you can let it sit for another two years and add another little bit of water and then run it again so it's, uh, you don't ever have to worry about um, running out of batteries. Um, this is really the ultimate emergency light uh, for uh, any kind of uh, situation where you need uh, something that is going to be there when you need it. And it's even gotten brighter. It'll, it'll keep getting brighter for probably uh, about half an hour until the all the ions really start flowing. Um, but again, it doesn't take much. And again, we use just distilled water. And um, so this is the Bedini Crystal Battery Light. So if you want it to uh, be a little bit brighter and uh, come up a little bit faster, we can add a little bit more water. And again, um, the, the unit uh, produces light in relationship to these, uh, this white crystalline material. Uh, going through a chemical change uh, where the crystal where the crystal grows 
So after you've run this a uh, number of times, you may notice that the, the white crystalline material is, is kind of rising up or growing a little bit. And when it dries out, you can just push it back down. It'll be crumbly. And you can just push it back down, and then um, you can do this cycle after cycle after cycle. But what I wanted to do now is, uh, this is a fairly uh, well-lit room, so it's pretty hard to see uh, how, how bright this is. But what I want to do is I want to walk you into a dark room and show you what this is. We're just going to go in here because this, this room has no lights at all. And turn the switch off. Right, so in here, okay. you can see it's pretty dark in here, okay? And, and now, so... Just like an LED flashlight? Like a little LED flashlight. But it's certainly, uh, it's enough, it's enough light for you to get around. And that's the whole point. Um, you could, you could read, you could read a book by this. That's, um, that's plenty of uh, light to read a book. Um, you can, you know, just, you can see that there's plenty of light to see by. So, um, uh, and this will run anywhere from 12 to 36 hours um, for just that much water that I put on it. So, um, um, that, you know, that demonstrates uh, what this is, this is capable of. Um, it's obviously not as, as strong as uh, the latest LED flashlights, but this has the uh, added capability of, uh, this has the added capability of being able to sit on a shelf for 12, 15 years, and when you need it, you can add a little water to it and it will light right up. So. So that's uh, the uh, Bedini crystal battery light, and I'm Peter Lindemann, and this is Tesla Chargers.